New tonight, a Farragut man continues to shine as a pillar in his community. Anthony Lindsay has been working at Top Golf since July of this year as part of Emory Valley Center's Workforce Development Program. That group matches employers to workers with disabilities. Reporter Aaron Velasquez tells us more about the impact Anthony has on his community. Anthony Lindsay is a 34 year old man who always keeps a positive attitude. Something his coworkers say makes their job nicer. He's always like really in a good mood. He's never like frowned yeah. down anything like that. Anthony says his smile comes from his ambition to make others happy. A lot of the things that you do are for the people that are around you. Yes. Why do you think you do that? It makes me smile every day. Anthony works at Top Golf. It's a job he started in July through the Workforce Development Program at Emory Valley Center. He comes to work and has fun. He doesn't have the most glamorous job, uh, mopping floors or cleaning up spills and uh, um, things like that, but he, uh, he enjoys the work and uh, we love having him. His job is close to his alma mater and he's no stranger to the Friday Night Lights. I like to uh, help with the football team at Farragut High School. Go Admirals. Anthony graduated from Farragut in 2008, and he's been returning every Friday night during the fall. Uh, yeah, and our players really, they feed, they feed off his energy, and they feed off uh, just seeing him, how he approaches life, and how just fortunate they are to play. As I said before, he kind of lets them know it's, it's a great game, man. You're lucky to be able to play it. I mean, he, he'll say that, yeah. And if you plan on saying hello to Anthony, expect a warm response back. How are you guys doing today? Good. Aaron joins us now in studio to tell us more about Anthony. Hey, Aaron. Katie, it's National Disability Employment Awareness Month, and Anthony serves as an example of just one of the thousands of workers with disabilities nationwide who can have a deep impact in their workforce and community. Back to you, Katie. Aaron, thank you. Looking